update, Sony has now confirmed that these are not official Venom molds, dash the design for Tom Hardy's titular symbiote in Venom may have been revealed through concept art for the upcoming Eddie Brock solo movie. After, Sony Pictures failed to launch their own shared superhero universe with The Amazing Spider-Man 2, the studio struck a deal with Marvel Studios to bring Spider-Man into the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Tom Holland's Peter Parker debuted last year in Captain America, Civil War, and received his first solo film in Spider-Man Homecoming, which has already been granted a sequel. Still, Sony wanted to continue to put their Marvel Comics characters to good use, and gave the green light to Ruben Fleischer's Venom starring Tom Hardy. Since then, Sony has also greenlit Silver and Black, directed by Gina prince Bythewood, and put a Morbius the Living Vampire movie into development. However, Venom will be the first of the studio's Spider-Man offshoot films to hit theaters, and as such, it's currently filming. While we've seen glimpses of Hardy on the set of Venom, we've yet to see him in any kind of costume for the symbiote, or motion capture gear for the role. But art for Venom may offer our first idea of what the symbiote will look like in live action. Artist Michael Franson who uploaded some photos of a sculpture he did of Venom to his online portfolio, may have revealed a basis for what fans can expect from Sony's film. Though only of the head, neck and part of the chest, the creature sculpture depicts a startlingly realistic and detailed rendering of Venom. Friends and uploaded some photos to the Instagram of his company, Creature Monster, take a look. Venom updated sculpture. Last share. Sculpted by Michael Franzen, Venom is copyright copyright Marvel Studios hashtag 3D hashtag 3 print hashtag art hashtag art top day hashtag monster hashtag sci-fi hashtag alien hashtag aliens hashtag UFO hashtag creature hashtags brush hashtag artist hashtag toys hashtag collectibles hashtag Spider-Man hashtag Marvel hashtag Venom hashtag Marvel comics hashtag comic hashtag comics hashtag superhero hashtag symbiote hashtag comic books hashtag creature hashtag monster hashtag art Artist hashtag art top day hashtag art hashtag follow may post shared by creature monster at creature monster on December 18 2017 at 3 54 p.m. PST venom updated sculpture sculpted by Michael Franzen venom is copyright copyright Marvel hashtag 3d hashtag 3 print hashtag art hashtag art top day hashtag monster hashtag sci-fi hashtag alien hashtag aliens hashtag creature hashtags brush hashtag artist hashtag toys hashtag collectibles hashtag spider-man hashtag Marvel hashtag venom hashtag Marvel comics hashtag comic hashtag comics hashtag superhero hashtag symbiote hashtag comic books hashtag art hashtag spider-man homecoming a post shared by creature monster at creature monster on December 18, 2017 at 11.45 a.m. PST, Venom Updated Sculpture Sculpted by Michael Franzen, Venom is copyright copyright Marvel Studios hashtag 3D hashtag 3D print hashtag art hashtag art top day hashtag monster hashtag sci-fi hashtag alien hashtag aliens hashtag UFO hashtag creature hashtag brush hashtag artist hashtag toys hashtag collectibles hashtag Spider-Man hashtag Marvel hashtag Venom hashtag Marvel comics hashtag comic hashtag comics hashtag superhero hashtag symbiote hashtag comic books hashtag creature hashtag monster hashtag art Artist hashtag art top day hashtag art hashtag follow may post shared by creature monster at creature monster on december 17 2017 at 252 pm pst now it should be noted that franz and lists unannounced title 2018 on his website as a project on which he worked during 2017 which could be confirmation that this Venom sculpture was done in prep for Sony's 2018 film. However, what's curious is that Franzen includes copyright attributions on his three Instagram photos to Marvel Studios, well, two to Marvel Studios and one to Simply Marvel. While that could be the case of Franzen simply attributing the character to the company that created it, or a mistake, it also may be an indication that this Venom sculpture was done for some other project. Since Sony retains the character's live-action film rights, though, it's unclear what other project that could be. It's entirely possible that Franzen's Venom piece and the mysterious 2018 project on his resume indicate this is an early design for Hardy Symbiote. It's certainly very close to the comic book version of the character in terms of style, and the timing of Franzen's project seems like too much of a coincidence. We know that Hardy is doing motion capture for Venom, but it's unclear if the symbiote will be entirely digitally created or, as this sculpture may hint, only his neck and head will be built with CGI. As such, this sculpture may be put to use as concept art for the film's digital artists, but that remains to be seen. Screen Rant's own Stephen Colbert added some color to the photos of Franz and sculpture that gives the images a more comics accurate appearance. Take a look, pic.twitter.com slash sc0pmcom, coffee, Stephen M. Colbert, at Colbert. 
December 20, 2017 as filming continues on Venom, and we see more glimpses of Hardy on set, it's possible we'll learn more about how the upcoming movie plans to bring the symbiote to life, or, Sony may try to keep as tight a lid as possible on the project. Thankfully, with less than 10 months until Venom is due in theaters, it may not be too long before we get an official look at the film and its titular anti-hero, source, Mc